Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. In this video, we'll be going to discuss about the TS EDZ counseling documents. What documents are required for counseling? So let's see. Uh, you should have a TS EDZ rank card, uh, result card, and uh, marks memo or mark sheet of SSC, and mark sheet of uh, intermediate that you can say as a twelfth class mark sheet, and uh, then you should have a mark sheet of uh, degree UG degree. Uh, graduation degree and if uh, you have a PG degree also you should show uh, that mark sheet as well uh, in case you have the uh, PG you hold a PG uh, graduation as well yeah, and also if you don't have the minimum marks for UG and you have done PG also so in that case also you need to show your PG certificates as well then you need to uh, have like a provisional degree certificate of original uh, UG, UG certificate okay and the provisional original certificate PG certificate with minimum qualification marks in degree and a study certificate from class 9 to 2 graduation or the study certificate you did show resident certificate for 7 years okay 7 years resident certificate you should show in case of individuals who have a uh, like uh, if they have done from distance or open, uh, set, uh, if they have done from distance or open school education, they should so show that as well. And uh, the uh, OC candidates, those who are OC applicants, they should show economic weaker session uh, reservation criteria. Uh, okay, and uh, for non-local candidates, the student certificate is uh, required. Uh, either from the Telangana for the duration of uh, 10 years okay this is demanded one for non-local student okay and the TC or for your if you have completed your PG you should so show your PG uh, TC or if you have just completed your UG then you should show a UG TC okay and then a uh, cash certificate BCUST ST ST whatever may be EWS uh, economic weaker section uh, uh, certificate from MRO Tasildar, which is valid for this year 2022 to 2023 year ka validation ka EWS certificate hona chahiye. Muslim and uh, minority certificate if a, st if a student have a SSC TC uh, in place of minority certificate you can upload your SSC TC okay and in case if you don't have the SSC TC then I have uploaded one video about the minority status certificate how to make it I'll uh, give the link in the description box from where uh, you can able to uh, know what how to do if you don't have a ssc tc okay if you have that then there is no problem you can uh, uh, keep that in place of minority if you don't have an absence of ssc tc you should show that certificate okay i have uploaded it on my telegram channel and if you have any special category certificate you can uh, upload that as well and the pw certificate also you need to upload if you are uh, eligible for that and let us parent income certificate of 2022 you need to show that and other card as you know that other card is mandatory now non for non local uh, student uh, they should consider consider for allotment under unreserved seats so they should present some documents like uh, they should show the credentials like uh, this important credential about resident certificate uh, bef uh, above we discuss about the resident certificate of 10 years they should show about the 10 year duration of a resident certificate who non-local students right and employer certificate uh, you know employer certificate if they are like uh, who are employed their parents are employed from state or central government public sector local bodies any from there so they should show that employer certificate as well this uh, is the list if you want to download this uh, pdf you can download it from my telegram channel i will give the link in the description box or in a comment section thanks for watching if you are new on my channel please subscribe my channel